Okay. I'm having breakfast right now. I just woke up. It's about 10 o'clock. It's my day off. I'm one of those people that are considered essential, so I still got to go to work. Mm. Having French toast and one egg and a glass of orange juice. One slice of French toast, one egg, and one glass of orange juice. I thought I'll make a randomness video because y'all are truly getting on my goddamn nerves with this. It don't make no goddamn sense. With this quarantine. Like, I understand the concept of quarantine, but I feel like y'all are just losing your mind and y'all just getting on my goddamn nerves. I feel like y'all have too much time and y'all don't know what to do. And you just lack creativity. So, I compose a little list of something you can do so you can stop getting on my damn nerves. And others. Because it... There's always a bunch of foolishness on the internet, but I feel like it just quadrupled ever since this quarantine thing or whatever happened. But anyway, one thing I think people should start doing is stop doing unnecessary things. Right. If I see one more damn TikTok video, I'm going to throw my phone out the window and hit a homeless person. And yeah, that's mean, but at least the homeless person will have a new phone. I would say this is the time to deep clean your house, but I'm pretty sure y'all already done that. At least I hope you have. You should have been doing that anyway. <clears throat> But that's besides the point. Another thing you can do is make a scrapbook. There's some DIY uh, scrapbook, you know. Yeah, what is it called? Schedule, not schedule, plans. There's some DIY, DIY scrapbook options on the internet. I mean, because y'all spend all y'all time on the internet anyway. So you might as well put it to good use. That's something you can do with your kids. Cooking, like I know food is very scarce for some people, but you could learn to make it a different way. And you can have your kids cook, because a lot of y'all got your kids at home. You can help your kids cook with you. Teach them how to cook, hell. Now it's the time to learn new skills and use your time wisely. Uh, braiding, <laughs> if I wasn't at work, I would be watching YouTube videos and learn how to braid because but I don't know how to. You learn how to draw. I mean, we may not have a lot in our homes, but I'm pretty sure y'all got a pen and paper, right? Mm. For all you ladies that are into makeup and you have makeup, now is the time. If you're at home, now is the time to build that skill. And get to a level where you want to be. I just want to know how many books have y'all read since y'all been in quarantine? Now's the time to read all your books. You can, you can read the Bible from cover to cover if you're religious. Read something. Or write a book if you ain't got any at your home. Write something. Get, in, get into your poetic side. Explore your thoughts. You can't really explore your thoughts when you're in your mind. But if you write them out. You got a good headspace. You know what? I don't know. Get in tune with yourself mentally. Oh. I just want to say, buy orange juice. When I go to the grocery store, like, yeah, there's like no eggs, no bread, no, no nothing. But... I've been to a few um, grocery stores and they're stocked up on orange juice. I'm like, why are y'all not getting your vitamin C? Why are all the vitamins in stock? 
all the other stuff, all the vegetables, all this good stuff that help you build your immune system since y'all so damn scared. Why is that stuff in stock? But you got the, the other stuff that ain't gonna save you. That ain't, ain't gonna help you at all except fill your belly. Why is that stuff gone, but the stuff that's gonna help you in stock? That's one thing you could do. Go get some orange juice. How about that? Or go get some oranges. Go get, go get something that'll help you. Excuse me. But yeah, I feel like everybody on the internet, I just want to know how many books have y'all read? And now it's the time to get some good exercise. I expect everyone to come out this quarantine with a summer body ready. And I'm not talking about just that stupid little 10, 10 push-up talent that's going around. I'm talking about a nice summer body, like do some workout with your kids also create content for the content creators like i know my schedule is pretty much trash but i'm i don't know my days off i'll be tired because i'm still working but shoot if i didn't have to go to work i would be creating But no, there's a lot of ab challenges for you. For those of you who want to get those abs, there's a lot of, you know, quad challenges, uh, glutes for you to get your body right. Because you know you ain't going to be eating, right? Because you can't eat like you could because you can't go nowhere and you got to save your food. And even if you do have money to set to go get the food, where is the food? You got to go to like six different grocery stores to get what you want. So now is the time to like incorporate a nice, good diet. You stop overeating and get that workout, sis. I also think at times like this, it's pretty good to determine who will be the sacrificial lamb. And by that, I mean the person who's going to go out and get stuff that's needed um, for, like, the whole family. I I think I'm the sacrificial lamb. Like, I don't, I don't have no kids. Um, but, you know, I went out and got stuff for my brother, my niece's nephews, and, you know, my friend. She got kids. She needed stuff. So I went and helped her. And I'm, I'm fine with doing that because I'm already out anyway. I still go to work. And that's another thing. Don't be arguing with people who still have to go to work. Like someone told, I I was in a conversation online. I was like, oh, I can't stay at home. I'm essential. And I was like, well, not if you're dead. And I didn't go back and forth with them or anything. I, I um responded with the, what is it? That gift from Nene Leaks that I said what I said. But I'm not going to go and tune in and explain what I have to do. If I'm considered essential, I'm essential. Like... There's a lot of essential people out there that you didn't know they was essential until this time frame. But anyway, I'm a child care worker. What does this mean? I work at a residential facility. Who's at the residential facility? Kids that are in the system. And only the staff that works there are the ones that take care of them. There's not like a house person or anything. No, it's us. So I'm thinking like if we don't go to work, who the hell gonna take care of these kids? You get me? It's a hard job, and I'm I'm grateful to be working and during this time of crisis. But that's one thing. Learn learn how to stop arguing. Have unnecessary arguments with people. Find your inner peace. Go meditate. You need peace during a time like this, because a lot of y'all are freaking out. And it. Mm. Another thing. Did I talk about journaling? Yes, journal. Five and below, I, I don't think they're open, but maybe online. A lot of these stories, if you have that money to you know, buy certain things, you can get some journals, you can get some arts and crafts. You still have access to some stuff online, so I would explore that, research there, so you can have something to do. Um, I would say limit your time of Netflix and internet, and I, I need to work on that too, but... Mm, I just feel that was the time to be a better you. 
don't be snag stagnant what you are like learn how you you could come out of this a better person and push yourself towards that this orange juice is whatever i thought it was the regular orange juice but it was orange juice with the hint of mango and it's all right it's a little sweeter than what i like but mm. y'all i try to just go to work and come back but I, lately I've been having to go for a run. I like need to get my exercise. I know there's a whole bunch of in-house exercises you can do. And I've been doing those too. But I saw a clip of my 600 pound life and I was like, oh, I got my ass out and ran. Okay. And I'm going to run again tonight. Mm. Okay, my breakfast is over. Um, I think I said everything I want to say. Yeah, that's all I have to say. Um, I just need to share with y'all. Y'all get on my nerves. And I'm pretty sure y'all get on a whole bunch of people's nerves. I just feel like we don't know what to do during this time. But you need to do something to find peace of mind. You can't, you know, keep stressing yourself out. And you can't keep wasting your time on dumb shit. Anyway, um, yeah, this is my randomness video. I just had to come and share my thoughts. Um, if you like this video, subscribe, like, whatever. If not, okay. Leave your thoughts below. How are you surviving this quarantine? Like, what are you doing? What's your daily schedule? Yeah, what's your daily schedule? What's something you're trying to gain from this experience? And how are you making it through? Um... And yeah, that's it, y'all. I'm about to go.